How low can you go before you have to go up? If you're in the semiconductor business, you're already down to feature sizes of seven nanometers and still falling. Moore's law predicts a doubling of transistors on a chip every two years. It means you'll see enormous gains in computing power for applications like artificial intelligence, virtual reality, and high-end server farms. But what do you do with scaling approaches zero nanometers? What about all the apps where the cost of these super chips can't quite be justified? What do you do then? Welcome to the world of advanced packaging, where engineers have devised a number of ingenious schemes to combine the power of multiple chips into very small footprints. To do so, they go up instead of down. Signals move vertically as well as horizontally. This way, the signal's travel time between different points in the system can be held to an absolute minimum. High bandwidth memory, or HBM, provides a good case in point. Some clever IC designers figured out how to stack several DRAM memories on top of each other and then add an extra layer that connects them to a CPU or GPU in very close proximity. It all adds up to big performance gains in less real estate than ever. It also adds up to some interesting testing challenges. Each chip added to the package needs to be individually tested before the stack is created. And the contact points are extremely small and tightly packed. Probing them can be a tricky business. At Form Factor, we're more than just aware of these challenges. We're moving aggressively to solve them. Stay tuned for more. <laughs>